in this community. So again, 40 mile per hour gusts on the opposing side of those desert slopes and the desert floor. A surf advisory is right out towards the Pacific. So Friday and Sunday, we're looking at increasing waves. Today it's three to six, tomorrow it's like five to eight, and then Sunday the same goes. So I mean, these are really big waves. Be careful, rip currents are concerned. It'll be raining too. So again, good to stay out of the water when we have rain, runoff, bacteria levels go up. So we wanna keep you healthy. Low pressure's coming on in. We have a chance of rain as early as tonight. Now it could start up at 6.30, continue on this evening. Very slight chance and very light stuff for the most part. Spotty, I hope it is spotty right over San Dimas, but it's kind of a hit or miss situation. And then on Saturday, we have a better round of rain. Now we're looking at a quarter of an inch of rain. It's a 60% shot and it becomes more widespread. Overall, it's gonna be on and off showers for tomorrow. And then on Sunday, we have another round and this is really for Sunday night, and this is even a weaker chance, 30% chance and only a tenth of an inch of rain. However, what is going to transpire, some snow for the Sierra Nevada and even our local mountains, and snow elevations will fall down to about 4,500 feet. We're looking at one to two inches of first snow of the season, so it's something to get excited about. By Monday, we have a hard freeze and a very cold temperature. So if you're getting in your car on Monday morning, keep in mind it's going to be a really chilly start, and you might have to uh, scrape off a little bit of freeze and frost off that windshield with a credit card. Not a big deal, but over into tonight, we have, again, light spotty showers to summarize. Tomorrow, that smaller uh, weak chance.